So if I'm being honest, I'm pretty excited to show you guys the Daiwa Alexa TW300P bait casting reel. Before we get back to the review, we're giving away a $20 J&H gift card. To enter, all you have to do is subscribe to our channel, click the notification bell, like this video, and post a comment below. Why am I excited? Because a lot more people are going to move over to low profile bait casting reels in salt water because of this reel. This is the brand new Lexa TW. The body size of it, the body shape of it is very, very much like the Pro Rex. If you guys aren't familiar with the Pro Rex, that's a pretty new uh, reel from Daiwa. Um, it's more compact design. This is the 300 size. Basically, the 400 size is, is the exact same reel, just a little bit wider. And it's just really cool. The, the, these reels are just getting better and better, more robust. If you're a guy who fishes, you know, like uh, lever drag reels or, or saltwater conventional reels, big or round reels, I'm telling you, you should switch over to a low profile bait cast reel because if you don't think that this reel can handle what you're doing, it definitely can. I mean, we're talking brass main gear, stainless steel pinion, 28.7 pounds of drag, this really nice power handle with the EVA knob, aluminum construction, eight corrosion resistant ball bearings. I mean, all that in a small lightweight package. This thing weighs just 12 ounces. They're a lot of fun to fish. This one's a 6.3 to one gear ratio. Awesome free spool there. Turn the handle to engage. Cast control if you need it. And one of the main features of this, or one of the additions, is this T-Wing level line system. So by doing that, it gives you more space for your line to go out, and you can cast further with this. You know, it means, like, again, like, you can see how this is over to the side, so now your line will actually be here, right, rather than being over here without it. And then when you engage, it goes back to just a regular standard opening for a level line. Super easy to use, no problem. Nine ball bearings on this in total. This thing feels great. I mean, you turn the handle, it feels absolutely wonderful. Here's your drag, big uh, big star drag there. Infinite number of settings. And again, 28.7 pounds of drag, which is just stupid, absolutely stupid. Um, here's your tension knob. You can adjust that to whatever you want. And it again, it just feels great. The technology is getting better. The engineers at Daiwa are getting better, and they're really making a reel that can sort of do it all. I mean, this holds uh, 310 yards of 30 pound test braid, which is which is more than enough for a lot of inshore and even near shore fishing. It's got the power. Again, you could put this on one of the new modern rods and just have an absolute blast with it. I absolutely love it. 350 bucks. It is a, a high-end version of these uh, saltwater low-profile bait casting reels, but the technology is there, guys. I mean, this is this is really great for the industry. I hope to see more and more reels go this way. More manufacturers coming out with higher-end, better low-profile bait casting reels that are specifically for saltwater, because uh, more saltwater guys should fish reels like this. They are really, really cool. So check it out. It's the Dio Alexa TW LX TW 300-P baitcasting reel. You can get yours at jnh.com or on the JNH app.